I'm here with meteorologist Nick Wilson. Nick, we had another derate show yesterday that impacted five states. You were covering that yesterday for us. What did you see? Well, it started as a cluster of thunderstorms that turned severe right over the Omaha Council Bluffs area, knocked out tens of thousands of customers' power, and did some pretty severe tree damage there. It swept across Iowa, weakened a little bit around Des Moines, but the Quad Cities got slammed, Chicago and its suburbs got slammed just after the evening rush, and northern Indiana and southwest Michigan also saw significant tree damage and power outages before this thing weakened as it moved into western Ohio. What's it looking like for us today? Well, you know, yesterday morning before the derecho, the models were telling us a lot of different things. Some of them forecast a big squall line, a derecho, some of them didn't. And this morning, again, it's very hard to pin down the exact details of these thunderstorms well in advance. We do believe there is a severe weather potential across the same areas hit yesterday, but whether it'll be another widespread derecho type squall line or just more localized severe weather, really hard to say in advance, but folks need to be aware. How does this derecho from yesterday compare to other ones we've seen? Well, we had one a few weeks ago that uh, we were advertising a couple days in advance. That one was a relatively weak one, though it still was a derecho. This one is actually a little more substantial than that one. We ended up with about 300,000 customers without power from Omaha all the way to South Bend from this, and at least eight different incidences of semis being blown over on different highways in Iowa and Illinois. So that is some sign of just how widespread this event was.